New Testament scholar N.T. Wright says that the Bible is a story of God as king and becoming king in Jesus. And this royalty idea is all over scripture. In fact, it helps define who we are. We're supposed to be God's image bearers, royally reflecting him and participating in his reign. But not only is this really hard to think about because of the pervasiveness of sin in the world, but also because we don't live in a monarchy anymore. Yet, we still have to learn to trust and submit to God as king. Now, as a reminder of these things, God gave his people kings in the Old Testament. And the first three kings were Saul, David, and Solomon. And each one of them reigned for 40 years. And each one of them started out as a great, spiritual, awesome leader for Israel. But then each one of them fell and took a turn for the worse. And each of their kingships became more about them than God. So for us, these stories are deeply instructive. They are a reminder that only God is the true king. And they also point us back to our purpose, to royally reflect his reign in all the earth. But these stories also remind us of our brokenness and ultimately they nudge us to our need to continually surrender to Jesus as king. He is royalty come to rescue us.